topping up a little diesel and we've got the best price yet 115 best price we found yet let's see if we can beat that and as usual we don't there's many places in spain that you just don't fill up yourself so i've got this lovely young lady who's filling up Hello. for me <laughs> we're spoiled Plan A didn't work. The campsite that we've arrived at is actually shut until September unless you've made a previous booking. We'll have to push on, but lunch first. So that's the excitement of making it up as you go along. See, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't work. But there's no problem. Lindsay's now cooking up some lunch while I'm on here trying to find another suitable stop for us, which we will do. I can see the sea for the first time. Well, apart from when we was on the boat, Apart from, yeah, apart from when we were on the boat. <laughs> Since the boat. We're down southern Spain, Murcia. Heading towards the sea. We're going to try and get a little stop by the sea with a pool. So we've checked in and I've fitted on the pitch quite nicely as it goes. Quite a large um, pitch we've got. But the facilities here look great. Not cheap, I think I paid 53 euros for us. But they're also charging us for electric on top of that. So this could work out expensive with the air conditioner running. So we'll, we'll see what it is at the end. But check out the pool they got here. That looks nice. I think we get changed and go swimming. Oh yeah, baby. While the boys are at the pool, I'm taking 20 minutes to myself to enjoy a glass of sangria and flick through a magazine. At the moment, I'm reading Om Yoga magazine about Jessamine Stanley, who's a yoga teacher and body positivity advocate from the US. She is glorious. Readly allows me to browse hundreds of titles, both new editions and old editions. Thankfully, it's really simple to navigate. I can easily zoom in and flick through pages and when the inevitable mom or lens interrupts me, it's really easy to bookmark my page to come back to when they aren't hungry anymore. Obviously, I'm gonna say I'm into the yoga and the inspirational travel, but between you and me, I do like a bit of celebrity goss as well. Steve, <laughs> he's loving MMM magazine again. We used to get it delivered ages ago, but for some reason we stopped. And George's laugh as he goes to bed because he's discovered the, the Beano is absolutely wonderful. Usually Readly offer a one month free trial and then it's 7 dollars per month from there. However, if you click the link in our description, they're gonna give you a two month free trial. If it's not for you, that's okay. You can cancel at any point. So, my next dilemma. How do I entertain myself when we're driving to our next destination? How do I make the most of that time? What should my new passion be? I'm thinking wine. It seems lovely here, isn't it? It is. We can have a lovely evening swim in the jacuzzi. Oh. <laughs> Bloody kids! <laughs> There's Georgie swimming there. <laughs> there it Must be about ten to nine. It is, yeah. Pool's open till nine o'clock. Lindsay cooked up a wonderful dinner. Just pasta. <clears throat> easy and peasy pasta, a salad, a bit of bread. Yeah. And it has been a, a great stop as it goes, a nice sight. Yeah, I think they're doing a wild camp tomorrow. <laughs> we're going to mix it up. We're going to do two nights here, but we're thinking maybe we'll move on. Maybe we'll go to the beach. Kids want to go to the beach. I think tonight might have been a better world stop because it's a bit cooler. 
There's a nice breeze tonight. If there's a good breeze, it'd be fine, I think. Yeah, right. <laughs> oh, it's filthy. <laughs> oh, dear. Ah, uh, who knows? We'll see what we get up to. It's yeah. lovely. There's no rush. No rush. No all. rush to decide. And there's no decision that's set in stone, is there? Absolutely not. Make it up as we go along. You know that, guys. <laughs> Harry wants to do another night here. Do you have? Uh, what will we decide? What will we decide? <laughs> Let's see in the morning and it's pans out. Good morning. Good morning. What a beautiful morning it is too. It's glorious here. Yep. Just the odd little cloud. Lots of blue so at sky. Good stuff. Glad we've got the sunshade over the pitch to keep the glare of the sun off to keep us semi cool. Yeah. There's a nice breeze going through as well. We're staying at this site for one more night at least because Harry's poorly. Yeah, poor little fella woke up with a tummy tummy ache and was very sick first thing and has continued to be sick. Poor fella. So Lindsay's rehydrating him and giving him some medicine and hopefully he'll feel better soon. Yeah, just keep him topped up with the liquids yes. as much as possible. The pool here is amazing. It is fantastic, isn't it? It's a lovely pool. Yes. Really lovely. The pool does shut between three and five, so we want to get a dip before it shuts. Um, then it reopens at five and it's open again till nine. And we was in it last night, wasn't we, till nine o'clock? Till nine o'clock. <laughs> it was kicking out time when we was, got out. Yes. <laughs> oh, and it was fantastic. Yeah, it's probably the nicest pool yet, isn't it, here? Yeah. So that's the best thing about this site is the pool. Anyway, so we're going to have a dip now and we'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Lovely, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> Go -goes. Go -goes. It's now lunchtime. We've had a good dip in the pool and boys are hungry. They're always hungry, every couple of hours. But I wanted to show you what we used to cook on, on mainly, um, certainly in the summer throughout Europe. Um, it's always cooking outside. So we're fortunate enough to have an external gas point. And there we have a Kodak two cook, two pro, two burner stove hob thing. Um, the pro comes with these two griddle plates as well, which we often use. And we've currently got a Ridge Monkey on there with a Spanish omelette in. And give that a quick flip. And we've got the kettle on because George wants a pot noodle, doesn't he? I realise we've been here two days. I'm not, not showing you guys around the campsite. So, so a quick look around the campsite. Um, here's our pitch to start with. We've got a nice big pitch, number 11. Lindsay's done more washing. We've been sat out there for a couple of days. Um, there's some smaller and some larger pitches here. <laughs> Let me show you some of these. So we've got a tent over there. See, they're quite long, these pitches. Easily get us in there as well. Even some bungalows in there as well. And it's all got this net covering, which is ideal for sun. And give us shade in this heat. A few more bungalows over here. And more empty pitches. So there's plenty of space here. There's a lovely campsite. I think it was 52 euros and 90 for, for the night with use of the pool. There's been mainly, well, we're the only English people here. It's mainly Spanish. And not many people speak in English as well. But that's it. It's a small campsite. I've nearly walked right around it whilst I've been recording. More pictures over there. Nice little corner over there. Again, lots of shade. You've got outside washing facilities out here, washing up and toilets and showers on my left over here. There's the ladies. And pool's closed now. Closes at nine. Oh, look at that lovely, lovely pool. And jacuzzi area over there. Okay, you've got a kids play area right over here for the young kids. And in here, you've got table tennis, pool and stuff like that. A quick look around the toilets for you. Hopefully there's nobody in there. Toilets are through there. They're nice enough. And they've got toilet paper. Not all of them have got toilet paper over in Spain. And your showers are through there. There you go. 
decent showers. Great campsite. Very good campsite. I'm not sure what my electric bill is going to be because they're charging extra for the electric. I think I've got six kilowatts of electric included and anything over that is 45 cents a kilowatt. So let's see what the bill is when I check out tomorrow. Well, two days here we've been and uh, it's been a lovely stop for two days, I've got to say. The pool is fantastic. Best pool yet. But I guess we can't judge that properly because... We've only stayed at three sites really, so it is early days. Just packing up now, and then we're going down the road, 25 minutes away, we've got Villa Ricos, lovely little village, Villa Ricos, but we're hooking up with friends for a couple of days. So I was worried about nothing. The extra in electric was only three euros and 78 cents to have the aircon on for two nights. Um, so that weren't too bad. So total amount was 105.80 for two nights. So check this one out, guys. It's Bella Vista. That was a fantastic stop. We had two great nights with a wonderful pool, with the aircon on, nice and cool and be beautifully breezy, gorgeous. Harry's 100% fit as a fiddle today, so that's a relief. No one else has come down with anything, so we are pushing on south and heading to Villa Ricos to meet up with friends. Uh -huh. 